I'm Callie Lewis. You're watching Geek Brief TV. This is Brief 154. Gather around, kids and campers. Today I've got some exciting news of the scientific variety. If you thought Jeff Hahn's multi-touch display was early 21st century geek nirvana, four British researchers at Leeds University Department of Food Science just may have discovered something slightly more impressive. It's the scientific formula for the perfect bacon sandwich. In all its glory. N equals the force in newtons required to break the cooked bacon, FB equals the function of the bacon type, FC equals the function of the condiment filling effect, TS equals the serving temperature, TC equals the cooking time, TA equals the time or duration of the application of condiment filling, CM equals the cooking method, and C equals newtons required to break uncooked bacon. Now, here's the problem. At least half of you are not going to believe this is as cool as multi-touch, and it's for one simple reason. I don't have video. Well, that got me thinking we should just have a contest. I want you guys who are talented at deciphering scientific formulas, or is it formulae? to whip out a video camera and make one of these scientifically perfect bacon sandwiches. Or for our friends across the pond, bacon buddies. <laughs> Upload videos to podshow.com using Podshow's video spotlight. It works like YouTube, but it's prettier. Tag the video bacon science, all one word. The best videos, as judged by me, will win fabulous cash and prizes. Well, okay, no cash, but prizes. <laughs> there are loads of details in the show notes at geekbrief.tv. Maybe I'll make this surprise. It's an alarm clock from Extreme Mac called Luna. It is without a doubt the most customizable alarm clock I've ever experienced. Of course, it's an iPod dock, everything is. It has two alarms with independent source and volume controls so you can wake to your iPod and your spouse can wake to the radio or one of several buzz options. Customization extends to the length of the alarm and my favorite, the length of the snooze. You can increase the snooze up to 60 minutes. Maybe I won't give this one away because it also sounds great. According to a study by Piper Jaffrey, almost 85% of American high school students know about the iPhone, and 25% said they would buy one. TV shows is a new way to bit torn on a Mac. Like the name suggests, it's for subscribing to TV shows so they're automatically downloaded using your existing BitTorrent client. Torrent Episode Downloader or TED does the same thing at its cross-platform, but according to Adam Pash at Lifehacker, TV shows has an improved and simplified interface. One quick personal question. Do any of you guys buy into the idea of sick building syndrome? We've always thought of SBS as a phony baloney kind of thing, but we're starting to wonder. I started coughing last week and was really sick over the weekend. Neil started coughing on Friday and is really sick now. The thing is, except for stores, we haven't been around people or traveled for a few weeks. We've gone most of our lives without much more than short colds, but we've gotten really sick so many freaking times in the past year. I'm starting to wonder if it could be the building. If any of you guys have any insight, please leave a comment in the show notes at geekbrief.tv. I'm Callie Lewis. Promo code GB1 either stands for Geek Brief, Gigabyte, or Geek Bacon. You choose either way, it gives you 10% off at GoDaddy.com. Thanks for watching. According to a study by Piper Jaffray, almost what? For Jaffrey. Jaffrey. Like <laughs> you do sound like Steve Ballmer. Hundred dollars for a phone. <laughs> Whew, take a breath, Callie. <laughs> Another pod show video podcast. Stick it on your screen.